So when I went into a treatment centre, I didn't realise how insane I was. I didn't realise how all over the place I was. All I knew that my life was completely unmanageable. Um, I couldn't look at my bank statements. I couldn't show. I couldn't be relied on to show up if I made an arrangement to meet somebody. I never knew when I was going to be binging or not. So life was chaotic. And I remember their advice was um, before get in, getting into any sort of serious relationship, um, at that time I was single, um, see if you can keep a plant alive for a year. Now, I, did, I you know, I, I never did anything the right way around, so I didn't try that. Um, I did and failed, so I couldn't keep a plant alive. For a long time because I couldn't show up every day or even once a week or even even once a month to mind it. Needless to say, I did get into a relationship which was absolutely chaotic. Um, but as the years, the months, the days, months and years have gone by, I've, I've been able to show up. I'm no longer, you know, underneath the food and the need to overeat was a huge amount of um, fear and I, I you know there was always something wrong you know things weren't right as they were things needed to be different for me to be happy sometimes you know it wasn't okay just to accept where I was people weren't the right way I wasn't the right way life wasn't the right way nothing was right and it started by just accepting that things are exactly as they're meant to be today and slowly but surely I've been able to become more and more present to the point now where I can keep plants alive. Um, now it's been a slow journey and every year I get better. But today, if you look around behind me, these are all my plants now that I keep alive. It's raspberries and lettuce and there's some tomatoes coming up and some strawberries at the back and some sweet and some peas. And um, I feel for many years, I, I never knew if the craving for food was going to come over me and I was going to be taken off and, you know, um, not be able to show up for life. But I feel today I can show up for life because the food is put, put in its place. Um, for me, the boundaries around food help. Um, knowing when to start and when to stop eating sounds so basic and so hopeless, but that's the truth about me. I am that hopeless when it comes to food. And um, I'm able to consistently show up and, and, you know, I was, I couldn't mind plants because it was, I wanted to be somewhere else, doing something else, doing something more exciting, getting more, being more, whatever it might be. Um, but as my mind has slowed down, as I've become more centred, I'm able to enjoy just pottering around, taking care of plants. I never would have believed it. So um, it's more than just finding freedom from binge eating there's more to life there's um finding freedom from our own insanity as well with or without the food i'm not sure if that makes much sense to you i think it will if you have been where i was with food take care